Hi children, we have done months of a year, yes, at home, to look at the month, look at the dates, you, your parents, you, your sister, must be looking at calendar, a big, lovely, big, bold numbers are they, both at school, in the class, at home, sometimes in every room, you have calendars. And daddy must be looking at the calendar. Oh, today is your birthday. And the calendar is marked there. So let's look at the calendar today for you to know. It's the same thing that you have at home. Look. Look at this. This is the full 12 months calendar. Yes? Look at this. Now this is, this calendar is for the year 2021. Every year they have to make a new set of calendar because the days change. Okay? Now, here you have January. It begins first on a Friday. January. This is the layout of a 12 month. January, 31 days. February 28 days, March 31 days, April 30 days, May 31 days, June 30 days. Remember you did it? July 31 days, August 31 days, September 30 days, October 31 days, November 30 days, and December 31 days. So this is this is the calendar, the 12 months. See how colorful and nice it looks. Yes? Good. Now, let's go on. Look at this. Now this is January 2021 and it begins with Friday. Friday is the first day of the month of January and it has 31 days which ends on a Sunday. It begins first on Friday and the 31st is on Sunday. This, is the, this calendar is for the month of January. Look at the week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. All this is colored. They are holidays. Here you have read all holidays. Yes? Good. Let's look at the month of February. And here is February. How many days it has? 28 days. Do you love February? I do. Why? It's the shortest month. Good. Let's go on to our next month. What is that? Next is March. Month of March. You love March, don't you? Because soon your holiday will come. It's very clearly marked that days, the seven days, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. You can see it very clearly. One look at the calendar and say, oh, all in red holidays. Yes, these are Saturdays. Oh, so many holidays in the month of March. You're very happy. When you look at a calendar and you see red in between, you're very happy. Probably they are festival days. Let's look at April. Good. Now, how many days April has? 30 days. The month of April has 30 days and all Sundays and Saturdays are colored. Yes? Why do you like April? Because your holiday will begin. Exams are over. You get your results, your report card and you are happy. Good. Let's go look at the calendar of the month of May. Here is month of May. Your favorite month, holiday month, and it has 31 days. And you're very happy when the month of May arrives. And everybody's on a holiday mood. And you go visiting your uncles and aunts. Let's go on. You're making preparation for the beginning of a new school year. So let's look at the month of June. You get new books and new things for yourself, bags and uniform. And the month of June 
it ends. It has how many days? 30 days. It's a very exciting month. New class, new friend, new teacher. And you're very happy. Yes? Good. Next is the month of July. You're getting on with your studies. You're excited learning new things. And July. The month of July has how many days? 31 days. A very long month. Lots to learn. Lots to prepare. Yes? You're happy, aren't you? Good. Let's get on. Next month is after July. August. When you say August, how many days are there? 31. What do you remember about August? Yes. So, yeah. It's a month that you celebrate, Independent Day, and there will be a lot of celebrations at school. And you enjoy that, yes? Good. Next, after August comes the month of September. What is, what do you remember about September? How many days are there? There are 30 days. September is a month of examination. You finish learning June, July, August. Lots you learn and you sit for a short examination followed by holiday. So you love September and September has 30 days. And when you see what happens, when you see colored, nice red letters, red numbers, then it's, oh, that's holiday. I can go and visit my grandma. Let's look at the next month after September follows. October, months of celebration. October, sometime. October, what are the, what, how many days are there in October? 31. What is special about October? Yes, your Diwali will be coming any time. You will look forward to celebration. After October, what follows? After October follows November. And November has how many days? 30 days. Yes. All celebrations go on in November. Sometimes the Diwali comes in the month of November and you're all excited. Good. Finally, we get on to the last month of the year. After November comes December, the month of Santa. December has how many days? 31 days. Why do you like December? Good. You have a short exam, a Christmas celebration, carol singing and off you go for a short vacation. So, December is another beautiful month and the last month of the year.